Hello there, everybody. How's it going? Welcome back to another episode of the KSP Let's Play. And, well, we are actually back in point 2.0 for this episode. Yes, I wanted to get the uh, the rescue mission all finished up here. And uh, just wanted to take a quick little retrospective, if you will, at the previous, uh, well, two seasons, actually, because there's two seasons worth of stuff in this save file. But yeah, as I do that, I'm going to be also doing this mission. And first things first is to actually meet up with... Was it this? Yeah. Meet up with this guy that's going out at a super high speed. Holy crap, how am I going to catch him? Actually, I'm going to just switch to him real quick. <clears throat> so the reason why I went back to point 2.0 is... Well, basically, I just... I wanted to finish this mission. I've tried several times before to do a powered landing and that just didn't work. So I would like to try it again. This time with like six Kerbals in there. So, you know, no big deal there. <laughs> a little bit of life loss. It's all good. They'll be coming back in the next season anyways. And here I'm just deciding... So that thing's up at 30 kilometers, you're at 17. Does this have a... No, it only has a small port. Dang. Okay, well, let's just do a little sum sum here. Whoops, get that popping up there. There we go. And we will just try to... Well... I'm actually going to try to get this up to around the same orbit as the other thing. The uh, the probe. So that's target. There we go. Oh, we're coming up on that. I uh, got to burn. Got to burn north. Right? Yes. Right. Yeah, so I'm going to try to get the um, this, this little ship to, well, not meet up with the other ship, but to be somewhat close to it so that I can just, you know move to it quickly so I don't have to actually make two orbits or two rendezvous I'll well, basically I'll have to do two rendezvous anyways but you know there we go that's almost good it won't be like two long rendezvous it'll just be oops it's going too fast it'll be one longish rendezvous and then one sort of normal rendezvous and that should be perfect so there are, those are aligned very good and um, let's move them up a bit as well. Yeah, the prograde. Nope, that's a retrograde. Let's do a little spinorama. Whoop. There we go. Okay, too much. Too much. Probably gonna run out of fuel real soon too. Uh, yeah, we're doing okay. Should be okay. Might be able to circularize it. Okay, so you stay on my screen and you stay on my screen. Nope. You stay. There we go. For people that don't know how to do that, you just click on the uh, the PE or the AP, the periapsis or the apoapsis, and um, but click on the actual thing, so not when there's a little ball there, which that's for a maneuver node. Just make sure there's nothing. So you just click on the thing. It's a little difficult, but if you get in there nice and close, you should be fine. So 26, 27, 30. All right, perfect. That'll be good, and then we'll go around a little bit. Actually, you know what? Mm, that doesn't really matter. I'll leave that like that for now. I can always fix it up later on. But if everything goes properly... Where's my... There you are. If, uh... if Can I switch to this, please? Maybe. Can I not switch? Uh, okay. I, I think that switched. <laughs> Anyways... Uh, yeah, let's, let's get going, let's get off the surface. And I totally forgot I was going to say, where is the moon? There is no moon here. Okie doke. That is kind of strange. Let's, let's go back and go here and do it this way and hope the moon is there. Hello moon, are you there? Yeah, moon's present, okay. So the rescue craft, yes, switch to that. But, uh, yeah, I don't know if I finished my thought, but if all th if everything goes well, this is really stupid. Where's the friggin' moon? I've never had this bug before. I've seen it happen to other people, but 
I, I don't know why. Right, let's just exit out and we'll come back in and hopefully that'll fix it. Yes. But uh, yes, as I was saying, <laughs> I keep uh, not finishing my train of thought. If all works out well, I should be able to, well, meet up with both the uh, the random craft that dude took out to space and he's now orbiting because he's a uh, he's a strange man and yes he tries to take off and god damn it that's the wrong thing again well that's the thing we ought to attach to eventually okay can you just please switch oh, don't focus on the moon oh my god this is brutal I kind of I didn't want to make this a ridiculously long episode, but I'm having so much trouble just selecting things here. Oh my god! Come on, let's go. Let's try this again. So that rescue craft landed at the moon. Yes, perfect, good. Let's go. Please let there be a moon. Okay, this is stupid. It's... Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna quick save here, and I'm gonna take off and see what happens. Quick save. Hello? Okay, apparently I can't quick save. What the hell is going on? Mm, do I have to like restart my game? Is, is, is my game busted? What the? It was working before. You guys saw that. It was working just fine at the beginning. What? Okay, I'll be right back. I'm gonna restart my game, I guess. God damn it. Yep, be right back in a sec. Okay, well... We're back, I guess, and everything's fine now. Don't really know what happened before, so yes, let's just forget about it. And retract ladder. We're not doing too great. Oh, right, huh? <laughs> I was about to say, we're not doing too great on the fuel situation, but then I remember that I have this thing up here, which should have a decent amount of fuel. And it's actually coming up on us, so... I am going to, well, I'm going to select it first, set us target, very good. Get this up, there we go. Alright, well, let's, let's get going. Time to go back to Kerbal. See if I remember how to fly this thing. Should, hopefully, be able to, whoops, go where it's supposed to go. Nope, not that way. Going the wrong way, buddy. There we go. Oh my god. Cannot control you. Okay, get on the 90 and just stay there. And well, now we go to space again. Which should probably <laughs> raise us up a little bit more, huh? I hope we have fuel to get back up there because I'm getting a little bit worried right now, actually. Yeah, that's, that's not a lot. Is not a lot. So if I can actually make an encounter with this thing as soon as possible, <laughs> that would be just great. Oh man, we are gonna run out of fuel. Should be okay-ish though, because I do have a whole bunch of RCS, I believe. Mm. Oh my god, even with fine controls, it is a pain in the butt to control. Oh, man, I'm barely touching those buttons, and it is just flipping out of control, and there's the last of our gas. Alright, well, that's kind of poopy. And we went out too much. Alright, well, let's try to figure this out here. Do one of those first. Should be good. Oh, look, we almost have an encounter as well. Go back. Nope, that's not gonna work. We're gonna have to work on the angle, probably. Is that gonna is that gonna help? What, what you doing? No, you're not. You're not doing anything for me. Um, okay. Well, let's just get a stable orbit first. How about that? That that's stable enough. Oh my God, we gotta do. 200 meters per second with just RCS. I don't know if I have that much RCS. You might have to do some, some funky maneuvers here. I don't know. 
The burn's really only going to be 45 seconds. That does not seem right. Okay, well, I'll, uh, I'll believe you. I <laughs> probably shouldn't, but I will. We'll, we'll burn with... Okay, we'll start the burn at 40 seconds, just to be sure. Okay, that, that should be good. Yeah, the burn's, burn's gonna be six hours now. Yeah, that's, that seems a bit more right. Um, this is, this is not happening, really? Come on. I can't believe I didn't have enough fuel on this thing. I guess that's what I get for trying to go to Minmus and, and the moon after with just this without refueling in between. Did I not fill up these tanks? I can't remember. It's been so long since I did the other mission. Or the, the first part of this mission that I just cannot remember. Oh, yep, I don't I don't know what's gonna happen here. Just doing some time warp, see if that helps. Not really. <laughs> this is this is something else. Are we gonna crash again? We're so gonna crash again. Oh man, this is brutal. I don't, I don't know what to do. Let's burn up a little bit, I guess. See if that helps any. Yeah, this is. Oh man. So hoping this episode would be a little bit more than me just, just messing about with this, but it doesn't seem like it will be. And these poor guys, oh my god, I sent this rescue mission out to get them, and now they're they're gonna die. They are simply going to die. That makes me kind of sad. Yeah, there's, I, I can't, I can't do anything here. <sighs> okay, let me think, slow this down for a second. Is there anything at all I can do? I could try to land it, that's not gonna work. They're going too fast now to try to land it. That's where that's where I'm supposed to go. Okay, well. Dang, that, that makes me really sad. I have no RCS left, I have no fuel left. And we're coming back down. We're gonna impact really hard. Oh, oh, I know what I can do. Okay, okay. Um Well I can try. I can try my best. Doubt it's gonna work, and I don't know how many of these guys I'm gonna be able to rescue, but Okay. So you can you get yourself into an orbit? Maybe. Possibly. Oh my god. Come on, buddy, come on, you can do it. Get up to the app. Get up to that apoapsis. Face the ship. You you're going there. If he runs out of fuel and his... Okay, he'll be fine. We're good. We're still good. We're fine. Everything's fine, guys. Except for... these poor dudes that are gonna die. Oh, man. Okay, go that way. Go that way a bit. I wish the Kerbals had a nav ball. That'd be nice. Oh, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. You can do it. You can do it. Why is he not... Why Why were you facing the wrong way? Okay, sure, why not? That makes sense. Come on. Come on, get yourself an apoapsis. Or a, a periapsis, because you have an apoapsis already. Oh, that's why, because... Oh, that is so silly. Moving the map affects the... Uh, the guy as well. That's just... That's... That's... Come on. Come on, game! Okay, that's that's good for now. I just pressed X because I tried to cut the throttle. That's... Oh, I can't switch. Come on, come on. Who's next? Switch the target. Oh no, they're getting too close. Uh, okay, we'll leave the crazy man in there. Coralie, you, sir, you need to get out. You need to bail the hell out of there right, right now. Go, 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 go. Is that... That's Samson. Yeah, yeah, go towards Samson. He knows where he's going. Oh my god. <laughs> oh boy, this... I don't know if this guy's gonna make it. 
I don't think he's gonna make it, guys. Oh, God. Crap, 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 crap. <laughs> well, that's where we're supposed to go. Yeah, he's... Oh, come on. Well, his, his pal is definitely not gonna make it. And yeah, he's not going to either. Oh, come on, buddy. Can you at least land? I would be happy if you landed. Okay, don't know what that sound was. I'm not looking back. I think that was the ship crashing. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Oh, he's dead. What's this? A random RC. Oh, oh, yep. Okay, yep. So that ship exploded. <laughs> that is what's left of it. Oh, man. That sucks. Well, <laughs> I guess in the end, we did we did rescue Samson. Or we almost rescued Samson. Is that where we're going? Yeah, that's where we're going. Oh, boy. Okay, what, what happened there? Is that the camera switching on me? Yeah, I think it was. Are you still good? Oh my god, you actually have an encounter? Okay, 42 kilometer encounter. Oh! Oh, a 3.8 kil- Okay. Good job, Samson. Can I do anything to fix this? I do not know if this is doing anything. Do you even have fuel left? Uh, you know, 47. That's not bad. Okay, so... How do I get these to get closer? I don't know which way to be burning with this little guy. So that brings them... Um, hmm. Okay, what if I do a bit of that? Does that help? Oh god no, that does the exact opposite of what I wanted it to do. Okay. So we slow it down and we do that. I don't, uh, yeah, I'm not sure if I could, okay, so this is just confusing me here because I can't, it's not updating this info on the map, and I don't know if that's because, yeah, I guess you're just not controlling the guy when, when you're in map view. I've never really done this before, so that's why this is all over the place. Um, I don't really know which way to burn, to be honest, I wish he had a nav ball. Nope, not, not, not that way. How about that way? Is that gonna help? Oh, that helps a bit. How about that? Is that good? We're back at 3.9. Okay. How about if we do that? We mess it up some more. Okay, well, you know what? I'm gonna figure this out. We know that this guy's safe. So I'm gonna figure out how to get him orbiting or uh, rendezvousing and then we'll, we'll deal with that in a second. Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, yeah, I've got some, uh, some things to tell ya. So, first of all, this, this little dude did not make it to the rescue craft. Um, because I, I, I honestly have no idea how to pilot these guys without a nav ball. I mean, <laughs> it, it's just like flying a rocket, but having that nav ball there just makes it so much easier. But, you know, I decided to do something a little better, a little smarter instead. Um, especially because the probe does not have anything for this guy to hang on to. So, that, that wouldn't have happened anyways. So, I'm going to send him out to meet this guy, the crazy dude with the main scout. That did like two backflips in uh, like a three episodes ago. So, uh, yeah, I have an encounter set up. It is, it's, it's one of these. So, this is going to be like... Super high speed. We're yeah. I don't know what's gonna happen. We'll see. We'll figure it out. Why is that point seven now? I had it set up at point one before. Looks like it got messed up a little bit. Let's see if I can fix that. Oh, that's that's too much. Point. There we go. Point one. Leave it at point one. So basically, my plan is since it is like super high speed, I I could always when I reach this point slow down with this guy and pull down my orbit again. And chances are that's what I'm going to end up doing. But uh, as it stands right now, I'm going to try to get in this thing. 
um, as soon as I can. <laughs> so yeah, this is going to be very interesting. Let's, uh, let's get going. Oh, let's quick save before anything. Because <laughs> I doubt this is going to work on its first try. Yeah, this, this little guy, Samson. Samson is a brave Kerbonaut. He's, he's done several orbits of the moon. He's probably got some serious radiation poisoning by now, but hey, you know what? It's okay. He is, uh, he is one of our bravest test pilots we've ever had. And I would very much like to get him back home. If there's anything, anything I want to accomplish this season, it's to get Samson Kerman back home. We'll see if it happens. <laughs> okay, here we go. Getting close, getting close, very close. Sorry, let's save again. Switch to Samson. I'm so scared right now. Okay, where is... Oh, I should probably select the thing first. It's this thing right here. Yeah, it's coming in at a really high speed. Our encounter is still pretty good. It's point two again. Unfortunately, where is the thing? It should be back there somewhere. Okay. Well, let's save again. I don't even know why I keep saving. I absolutely do not need to save like 50 million times in the span of a minute. But I'm going to. So, all right, Samson, you ready for this, buddy? You got enough? Yeah, you got you got a decent amount. There it is. It's coming in. It's coming in hot. Hot, 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 hot. Okay, we need to get ready. Get ready here. You got to move up a little bit. <laughs> this is not going to work. I'm, like, going to get hit by it. Come on, come on. If I can grab onto it as it flies by, though. Oh my god, camera, seriously? That is the worst possible time to do that. Come on. Man. I, it flew right by me. I doubt I would have caught onto it, but. Ugh, oh, stupid camera. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna do it the smart way, because. I don't want to bother to do it this way. As much fun as it would be, it is. It's chances are it's not going to work, and it's going to take a lot of attempts, and it's going to be super freaking frustrating. So we'll do it this way. We still have fuel. We still got RCS. We'll be fine. And after we meet up with Samson, well, shoot, I don't really know what. No, oh, dang it! Just clicking on the wrong buttons. Yeah, I don't. Uh, I don't know what we'll be doing after because. The uh, the probe that brought that um, the resi craft over here does not have a small docking port, so that's that's kind of crappy. But uh, it also um, it should have enough fuel. I'm hoping. I'm crossing my fingers here for this, hoping it has enough fuel to get us to the station up here. Which is also part of the reason why I wanted to have it set up like that, so I don't have to, you know, do another orbit afterwards and all that. I wanted to catch him in one go and then meet up with the station later, but that's that's not happening, so we'll do it this way. And, um, yeah, we'll try to meet up with the orbital station there, and I think that has... Pretty sure that has one of the big uh, Rockamax orange tanks attached to it, so that should be fine. Okay, we're coming in kind of hot. Let's uh, let's slow down here. Okay, let's slow down quite a bit. Okay, that'll be good. And now we can use RCS for the rest. I don't want to waste too much of the normal fuel because, well, you know, you know how it is. Come on, stay on target. It's fine as long as we come to a rest more or less nearby. That's that's all good. You can take the trip over. He's already been on quite an adventure so far. Quite an adventure indeed. And that should be good. Alright, let's slower down to zero. We'll switch over to Samson and he'll make his way over here. Oh man, this is some mission. It's been a lot more frustrating than I thought it would be. I mean, just a simple mission to, you know, rescue a little guy. Turns into... A not so simple mission. Yay! There's your ride, brah. Let's go. Let's go home. Well, oh my god. 
this camera. Be nice if there was a way to turn that off. Because it just messes up the angle that you're you're facing, especially with the Kerbonaut, since they're they're kind of strange like that. Because before, for example, I was oh look, we're almost back. Oh crap! <laughs> Oops, <laughs> I was too busy looking at stuff. Dang it! Let's let's go back, I guess. Oh, there's the oh. And now the movement is all weird again. I can't... Okay, select that. Okay, good. Now I can see what's going on. I can't tell... Okay, I'm moving... I'm having trouble telling which uh, relative direction to uh, to cut my speed in. I think we're good. I think I need to... Do a little bit of this, and a little bit of this, and a little bit of this, and a bit more of this, and we should be good. Okay, where's the entrance? Hello. How are you, crazy man? I guess these guys are a fitting couple. We have the one dude that in the the main scout that did a couple of backflips when he took off, and then we have this guy that did a couple of backflips when he crashed. <laughs> and yes, bored. Excellent. Okay, I have no idea how I'm doing on time. So real quick, let's just see what it would take to meet up with the orbital facility. Set as target. Are we... nope, of course we're not. Why, why would we be aligned properly? Even though that is set up for the equator. You know, I'm sure, why not. But whatever, just out of curiosity, see how much fuel it would take to get up there. Can I get an encounter? Ah, it's not a bad encounter either. Especially if I fix it like so. Well, that's that's not gonna help at all. How's that? Is that gonna? Nope, that just makes it a hell of a lot worse. Yeah, because I have to. When you try to do your inclination adjustment, try to do it at the descending or ascending nodes to get it done properly. Otherwise, it just ain't gonna work. I mean, you'll get you'll get some of the variants cut out of there, but there's still going to be some issues and it's not going to be perfect. Anyway, whatever, that's 90 kilometers. I just wanted to see roughly how much I have to burn to get up there. 44 meters, we'll be fine. We will be fine. I find it kind of amusing that after all that, we ended up not having a rescue craft and doing the final rescue maneuver over the rescue site. Okay, well, anyways, I'm I'm probably going to leave it here for now. Oh, I think I may have just hit my mic there. And, yeah, sorry, but this episode was a little, little iffy there, a little seat of your pants. We lost two Kerbonauts, unfortunately, but we did rescue one, so that is something. We rescued the most important guy. And in the next episode, we will go back to Kerbin, I guess. Maybe? I really didn't want to do another one of those back in point two oh, but I kind of do want to attempt another powered landing. And I feel like I owe it to these guys to make it home, so I will probably attempt that. Anyways, guys, thanks again for watching. If you enjoyed, well, you know what to do. Looking forward to hearing all your comments and all that other fun stuff. And I'll catch you in the next episode. Take care.